So welcome to Valhalla Forever. Valhalla is now going to be a weekend event, much like Atlantis Rises. It's going to be one of many events in the calendar making way for the big end of month event, which is season four, which is going to have more powerful characters for everyone to invest in, which is what small giant no doubt want so to keep this event relevant valhalla has become valhalla forever and includes cheaper energy cost to complete stages as well as that we now have midgard gnomes so the midgard gnomes very much like the special enemies we see in atlantis rises so i was lucky to find three of them this morning I'm playing the last stage on hard mode, very much taking advantage of the decreased energy cost. As you can see, these are very different type of gnomes compared to, say, a Grimble. Grimble definitely was front of the queue in terms of looks when compared to the Midgard gnomes. But if you go into your Scandinavian Norse mythology, there's a big, big variation of types of gnomes. These gnomes, I assume, are closer related to the Siberian gnomes in North mythology, which used to hang out with trolls and orcs and so on and so forth. So, as you can see here, I found a third gnome. They have a lot of HP compared to their other enemy counterparts. I'm playing the last couple of stages of Valhalla on hard mode. So I very much brought my strongest team and very, very strong items. And I'm glad I did because a couple of times I came very close to losing Mother North as I was taking on these little gnomes, but don't take them lightly. Um, but they are worth five coins each. It's five Valhalla coins each. There is a warning. As you can do see at the beginning of the video so when valhalla rises launches it will say that there's a limited number of midgard gnomes available so I'm not sure how true that is but i assume they're trying to get you to front weight your energy to build up valhalla coins so you pull at the beginning of the event so you're more likely to continue pulling and paying for pulls um, rather than saving your pulls for the end, which is a quite good strategy to avoid overspending on events. That being said, it's great that they're now featuring the Valhalla heroes. Three Valhalla heroes are featured. We've got Heimdall this time, who was uh, an original hero, and then two of the featured heroes. Fenrir was the very first featured hero who was available in the very first Valhalla. And then Gifion was uh, available much, much later. So very good idea if you have enough heroes stocked up and you can wait, wait for your favourite heroes uh, to be launched in the Valhalla event. Very much going to be waiting for Skadi, Loki, Lady Loki to be featured. Maybe I'll be lucky enough to have all three featured in the same event. But yes, until that time, I'll be farming these stages. Uh, I think on hard mode, you're going to be getting five for a Midgard Gnome. So therefore, I assume three for a easier stage, normal stage. Um, so you've got five there for completing the stage and then one for the one I've just completed. Thank you for watching. Hope this was helpful and goodbye.